Lambert Acres here. Welcome to my man cave. Uh, we're going to be doing a review and this is a different type of product that I would normally do a review on, but I like the product and so I wanted to give them a shout out and say that it has worked for us and it's worth looking into for you if you have a dog. So basically, this is Starmark and this is the Tetraflex, um, which is a training and behavior solutions, uh, provides hours of mental and physical stimulation, dispenses, treats, or kibble, turns mealtime into playtime. This is dishwasher safe and help prevents destructive boredom behaviors. Uh, and then you can put their treats in it. This is the large because I have a large dog and you're gonna see that in a second. Uh, this is for mental stimulation. And it tells you on the back, you know, little tricks. You can cut a water bottle, stick it down here. Now, I just put this in here for looks. We've had this for like a year and I've held onto this uh, because it was like a money back guarantee. So that's what it looks like, okay? I'll let you guys see it. If you want, you can pause it and read the crap if you want stuff so there you go um i did do a little alterations to this so basically this inside lip that you put the the dog food in is what we put in there um it goes down like this far okay so let's say that's two inches um and then we have really small dog food so the dog would be like rolling this for hours and like one piece of dog food would come out um, my dog does not lift the stuff up and drop it like a normal dog probably would. It just pushes it with its nose. Um, so what I did was I stuck my finger in here and then I pulled out this and then I used uh, my knife and I just cut it. So I don't know if you're going to be able to see inside there, but you can see the inside lip there, how it's like, uh, Mine's not straight anymore, it's like curved. So basically, it's like this. Um, so now, whenever it gets to that short end, it can uh, get the dog treats more readily. Um, let's go see this in action, uh, but then I'll grade it, okay? So let's see it in action, then I'll grade it. I'll give you my review grade. All right, so we got our ball, we got our kibble, we put it in there, ah, oh, crap, dropping it dog already knows what's up okay you got your ball here okay you put a handful of kibble in it that's what the dog does so he he's basically pushing it and he'll push it like that for hours <laughs> it's kind of funny um, but he'll do that he'll he'll lift it up and move it back to wherever he wants it and he'll just push it um, and then he'll eat the kibble off the ground and then he'll just keep pushing it. So right now he can't push it anymore. So he'll probably pick it up and move it or kick it like a soccer ball. But, uh, this is, uh, this is what we do. Um, cause sometimes, you know, you just don't want to babysit the dog and this, he's like, what, what? So he's not he's gonna push it all the way down the hall. So no just it's not hurting him. Okay, so there's other products um, <clears throat> that uh, you can buy from this company. We bought ours from PetSmart, probably 25 bucks or less. Um, and I'm not saying my dog needs a babysitter, but when you're doing something and you know you just don't want him being destructive, fill that sucker up and let him go. He's out there right now just rolling the ball up and down the hall. Um, and like I said, he'll do it until every single piece of dog food is out. I don't know if your dog will do that, but uh, mine will do it until every single piece of dog food is out. It's pretty cool. So I like the product. Um, I think it works very well. Like I said, the only thing I did was cut it. So because my dog treats are smaller or food is, is smaller, they uh, um, basically uh, use bigger treats sometimes too. Sometimes we'll put like a, uh, a bigger treat in there. However, 
it's like almost impossible for him to get it out because he doesn't pick up the ball and drop it like a normal dog would. Um, this says also, it says, treat dispensing system encourages play, which helps reduce anxiety and boredom behaviors. I don't think he really has anxiety behaviors, uh, but I mean, I think all dogs get bored just like people, you know, they're looking for something to do. So this, uh, this is definitely that. Uh, we also have the uh, dog food dish, with, which you feed him, which like um, has like raised pedestals all over. So he can't basically just get in there and eat his food real quick. Um, I mean, he's a, he's a poodle, so they need to, um, if they eat their food too fast, they'll puke. I don't know if your dog does that, but my dog does. So you gotta slow down, Johnny. Um, that is, that's my opinion of this is 100 being the best score I could give a product, zero being the worst. Um, I would give this a 90 because I mean, there's always, you know, things that you could do for better, but it's lasted a year too as well. Like I said, we got that a year ago and uh, I kind of wanted to try it, uh, before I did a review on it, um, long term to see if it would hold up and stuff. There's no puncture marks or anything. He's not a real hard biter. He's like a, a soft, like he just picks it up and moves it. This is the five inch ball. They have um, all kinds of sizes. They have small to extra, extra, extra big. So uh, this is the five inch, um, which is the yellow one, like you saw. Um, it's categorized as large. If, you've, if you haven't gotten something like this for your dog, you may as well give it a try uh, because uh, it will save you a headache and give them something to do. All right, like, subscribe, share the video, and uh, until next time, thanks, Mom.